Now, Central Oregon's local alert weather with Chief Meteorologist John Carroll. Well, we had some snow showers this morning in the lower elevated locations, and we had about four to five inches of snow up on the mountains. And here is a beautiful look uh, of Mount Bachelor. And looking at the outback, you see the mountains off in the distance. Uh, definitely beautiful shot there. The pine trees are covered with snow. That's a happy sight for those that do enjoy the snow in the area. Now, as far as travel is concerned, it's really not all that bad. It's relatively dry through the region. There might be some patchy ice in some spots, but it certainly doesn't look like it. We are on the dry side, so that's good news as well. Uh, here's what we got going on as far as our weather headlines are concerned. Uh, we are seeing a wintry mix return to the area on Saturday, and then that'll switch over to mostly rain on Sunday. Snow levels will be about 3,500 to uh, up to around 4,000 feet on Saturday. They'll be higher than that on Sunday, close to 6,000 feet. And then we're going to be dry most of next week. So here is a look at the satellite radar. It's mostly just a mixture of some cloud cover drifting in overhead with some clear conditions as well. Future track indicates uh, that Friday night, this is 9 p.m. tonight, we're on the quiet side. Flow generally up through to the north of us, but there's a pretty good system off the coast that by 9 a.m. Uh, we'll be having the leading edge be snow mingled in with some rain behind that. And as we get into our Saturday, this model here gives us a good chance for snow showers. Uh, in and around the 97 corridor, but uh, it won't last long. By 3 o'clock, pretty much most of it will be done. And as we get into Saturday, it's going to be milder. It's going to be warmer, and so we are probably going to see more rain than snow on Sunday, and it'll be kind of off and on throughout the day. And then after that, we're going to dry out. So how much snow are the mountains going to get? Well, it doesn't look like they're going to get all that much until we get into Sunday. And Sunday, uh, overnight Saturday into Sunday is when the colder air will be here. We do anticipate getting almost a foot of snow added to what we have already uh, in Mount Bachelor. Rainfall estimates will be a little bit aggressive as we get into our Sunday time frame at lower elevations, maybe about a quarter of an inch to a tenth of an inch in some spots. It's not a lot, but it's enough to... It'd make it a little inconvenient getting around. Winds will be noticeable but not overwhelming as we see gusts on Saturday in the 10 to 20 mile an hour range, speaking at about 25. Right now it's cold, 36 degrees with partly cloudy skies. I expect a 44 degree afternoon high tomorrow, 41 degrees at noon. Highs today were crisp in Sun River, 34, 39 in Sisters, but mild in Warm Springs with a 48. Now we look at the current temperatures and we're in the 40s and 30s through the region and the lows tonight will be in the teens and 20s so a crisp one tonight uh, with light winds and clear skies and then highs tomorrow will be in the 30s and 40s so our extended period does look like we're getting that wet weather and dry conditions coming in on Monday through next week